have this old ass here too. <laughs> yep, that's it. Here's a box. Uh, four days ago. Somewhat recent. But I was late to the wagon for 20 days. Hello, everyone. Watching a movie at my own pace. For fans of Left 4 Dead 2, this may come as a sort of insult. No shooting I'd also ahead. like to remind you, this dude only okay, played the point. first two chapters of Dead Center. That's all you see him play. Devin oh my god. Wow. Cat himself. I played Dead Center You're probably seen this video and you're recommended. If not, watch and the entire thing. Dead Center is like one of the best campaigns ever and he still fucking hates it. This guy just sucks. Too fan, you may have even like, In his own way, it's so funny. It's like fucking, um, well... I, I just love the part where he's bragging about, like, more is better than when, like, the campaign's like, there's so many campaigns, where do I start? Yeah, he doesn't like play any of those campaigns. He doesn't play any of them. Just all you, all you see in the footage is just the first two chapters of Dead Center. You can go ahead and watch the original video for yourself. I've left timestamps for you to fact check me on all this. But for now, let's assume this is all correct. Now, this let's remove everything check. that doesn't affect gameplay. Immediately, the video goes from 26 minutes and 16 seconds all the way down to 6 minutes and 56 seconds. Now, you may say, Wait, what? Of everything you to fact check me on all this. The 6 minutes. Oh. Don't fact check. But AI, so flashlights. Shut the fuck. <laughs> Audio cues, tank versus campaign. So. All the other things he doesn't care about. Me a little, those aren't important to That's game. Fair. I'll give him that. That's fair. It makes it feel like a movie. To which I say, yes, that's my point. The creators of Left 4 Dead 2 really put most of their effort into Did playing, he just, yes. Can you just grab the bile? Um, that's my point. He, the creators you expect of them to Dead be 2 smart. Really put most of their effort into making the game a cinematic experience, rather than making it a fun experience. The amount of effort put into zombies... First thing that made me roll my eyes. Let me, let me go back to this. First off, version. he says a bile. like a movie. Instead, he goes for the zombie, instead of killing it with four bullets, to which I kills it with nine bullets. He, yes, he ends up not taking the bile. The creators of Left 4 Dead 2 he shoots it off, actually. And then the he takes the other bile. Cinematic experience. And it takes him like solid five seconds to look at it and Rather then grab it. A fun You're also ignoring the part the where it's like, they made Left 4 Dead a cinematic experience, not a fun experience. What? Holy <laughs> shit. And, and then we get to the point of the vid where it's Honestly, Back for Blood dick sucking. And versus campaign. Granted, Back for Blood does not in fact have a versus campaign, and Swarm is, well, not a replacement. You know what? Also but citing allow a me to address video. It's yeah. pretty funny. Back for Blood's bot AI has historically suffered as the game has a very high skill ceiling. Oh, trying now, to high bad. skill ceiling. High skill ceiling. That is that yeah. is incorrect. Me putting a lot of cards. I play I play Back for Blood. There It's not really skill, it's more so um what what cards work best in this deck. Uh th that's not skill, that's just picking cards that are really good. I, put, I don't think that's very hard. I put cards. I am very OP. I get attachments. I am very OP. That's it. In solo, you'd only have 1,000 copper. That's an issue for sure. But it's not an issue that Left 4 Dead 2 ever had to deal with. Their solution was to have no shop. I failed to see how the solution to a slightly <laughs> unbalanced mechanic <laughs> is not attempting it at all. There's no this shop. Applies to both the Why is there no shop? Or Why would you? I just buy my way through the fucking game like a, like a Why would you want a shop? In Zombie game, man. There was another vid I saw where I agreed with basically everything you said. It's like, you want a shop and attachments, but all I'm really seeing is you you and your team stopping in place thinking while the horde's showing up. What? <laughs> it's just... Keep go just, keep, just keep going, just keep going, you'll see it. As well like, as when he zombies. starts talking about attachments. I two fans like to call the system that controls the enemy AI the capital G, capital D, Game Director. As if any other system can't level That's up just because you gave this one a special moron. name. Do some research. But I digress. <laughs> Back for Blood has its own game director oh in the form God. of the card system. Left 4 Dead 2 fans like to claim that this their game so director can malicious. sense how well you're doing yeah, and exactly. send you more or fewer zombies depending on your progress. Oh, if you're struggling, the, the, it will calm One of the other favorite parts he talks well, about is difficult to even more. really a thing. Back for Blood doesn't have this adaptive game director. And that's a good thing. 
Why? If I can't beat the game on the difficulty I set it to, then I want to at least know that the next time I play, I'll have learned and gotten better, until finally I can beat it. And when I do finally get there, I want to know that my hard work... Seriously? You're, you're telling me that he wants everything the same without any RNG, <laughs> without... It basically destroys the replayability. Zero replay value is what he's saying. Yes, yeah. zero replay value. It, it, it's... It, it's so fuck. It actually, you know what? Actually, speaking of, it got so bad. Fucking Freezerin is in the comments of this. Mr. G and B himself is even calling this dude an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Let's address the flashlight issue. It's true that in Back for Blood. Oh yeah. Mm -mm. You can't voluntarily toggle your flashlight, which is a bit annoying when trying to see into a car or other small unlit spaces. As well, your flashlight will always be facing forward even if you're reloading or using a melee weapon. Although, as a player, I can't imagine that would be fun not being able to see just because I'm using a hatchet. So once again, points to Back for Blood for ignoring real- He? He? I can't, I can't, I can't. He says being he's unable to control the flashlight way. is good. No, he's not. He is on other vids just like defending his point. Oh he is dead. He is completely <laughs> serious. He says serious. Uh, mental retard. He's serious. He is actually serious. He, he says when I'm reloading, I can't see, so that's bad. He's going on about like he. The whole point of the vid is that he said Left 4 Dead's a walking sim, but now it's turning into Oh, Back for Blood is actually uh, no, not as like is like better than you people think. I can't with this, uh, no. this <laughs> argument of flashlight, I can't. We don't always get the movie like piano notes of Left 4 Dead 2. Back 4 Blood uh, does have no. the more realistic. Yeah, there's women. I don't know if they're your taste, players. though. Something you would learn from actually playing the game. We'll just, we'll just say they, they don't have one. Let's go! I'll be the judge of it. So, uh, so it says can... zombie noises are better indicator wow. than music indicators. Uh... <laughs> oh, like that, like that indicator. Yeah, like that, that's on the indicator. This yeah, the no, no, noises that you probably, <laughs> the noises that you will probably not hear in gameplay because there's a horde and gunshots every 10 seconds. The fucking piano cues. Yeah, they, yeah, Back for Blood doesn't have music like that. that only a small it's like the, of the sounds of zombies will get drowned out by gunfire, that's why there's music. I'm pretty sure Left 4 Dead 2 also has like distinct spe special infected sounds either way. They do, but they do. They do, but the music is there for when like it's there, so that way if you miss the noises, it's like because Valve is smart and realizes, oh yeah, there might be a moment where like a horde's going on and there's gunshots and they can't hear. Yes. Yeah. And then back from doesn't do that. Music indicator is more of you get from more far ahead. You get the indicator. You get closer to the infected, and you get to hear their voice. So music indicators just let you know beforehand when it's gonna show up and don't jump scare you. Exactly, and also like during a horde too, it, it helps out. Obviously. Left 4 Dead 2 has 8 specials. The Witch, the Tank, the Boomer, the Charger, the Hunter, the Smoker, the Jockey, and the Spitter. Immediately you can try to make connections between some of these as the original video did, but let's take a look at all of Back 4 Blood specials. First, we have our first class of special, the Stalker, Hawker, and Stinger. And their recolors. I just love how he's like, oh, there's 20, there's 24 special infected, um. You can literally see they're just risk. <laughs> exactly, it's like, on, I, I played Back for Blood, like, when he talks about the clap, all the higher tier of specials do is that they just have armor and you need to hit a weak spot. That's not much gameplay depth, that's just, Ooh, I'm taking just, this enemy but giving him armor. It's just aim left. Oh, Jack, <laughs> it's just aim left. Jucky, but I need to shoot his waist. Oh, Jucky, but I need to shoot his head. Uh, you could take a point off from the snitch. The snitch is literally like something Valve wanted to do, the screamer. They snitched on Valve. Didn't, yeah. they, didn't they, like, scrap that because they thought it was, uh... Stupid, much? yes. They yeah, The reason why the Screamer was dumb is that it ran away. I actually think Back for Blood did it well. Like, um, when it spots you, it takes a few seconds before it starts and it stands still. That's fine. You get yeah. plenty of time Already to, like, take it down. It just becomes a That's fine. But it doesn't stop there. Get that In DLC 1, we got the Urchin, the Ripper, and the Shredder. What did I take damage Uh, just... Spikes added to the default zombies. Yep. 
Then in DLC Snipes. 2, we got the cultists. The clone, Ow, the sniper, the slasher, and... Uh, yep, humans the DLC in, enemies. Humans and left for dead. DLC enemies! Fuck off! DLC. That leaves us with 20... That's Mr. Krabs, dude. Removes 23 special infected! Three There's 23 special, special enemies! More is better! abilities and having to be dealt with accordingly. The depth here is incredible. Different abilities part is bullshit. Really it's not it. depth. Somewhat related. Yeah, Lester exactly. Like has taking an enemy and putting that's armor not, on it. That's not, oh, that's I, I fucking that's love. I love this part right here. Left 4 Dead has 33 weapons. Not bad, but Back for Blood has 43, 42 actually. That's that's not that many more, honestly. Notice how the Back for Blood wiki cares less than the Left 4 Dead wiki. Yeah, exactly. Look, look at the Soul versus Savalus. Look at the icons and no icons. Look, what if? Left 4 Dead Look makes. The line packs next to the logo. What if Left 4 Dead community patch happens again and it has the fucking Japanese gun? Then then he's immediately fucked. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> because it's gonna be just oh 55 God. guns. I don't know, and it's just reskins of others, but it is fine for him. And on it's top it. of that, each weapon can be upgraded. Oh, yep, this part where he's like, attachments. Oh, yeah, attachments and rarity. Upgrade system. As well, it diversifies your selection. Also, guns can have attachments. Some guns can only hold two, but most can hold four. With these attachments doing anything you from increasing your magazine bitch, size or giving you a rest. I like I would say Left 4 Dead with attachments would go hard, but it would probably just end up being like Fallout 4 where you just, oh yeah, let me just get a suppressor on everything. GG. <laughs> Yeah, but my issue with attachments is that like it's you'll see it when a clip starts up him and his team like open up a supply cache and they're just sitting around like jackasses deciding on attachments while like Ooh. the zombies are like just like approaching it's really funny mm. <laughs> instead of just deciding a gun immediately i need to decide yeah. what attachment yeah is better. back Back for Blood, like, or Left for Dead's, like, flow, like, remains uninterrupted. You see weapons, you quickly decide, then you move on. Didn't he just The say, flow is basically uninterrupted. Didn't, didn't you tell me? He said sitting and deciding for guns. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah you're bad. gonna see it. it. It's in this segment. Okay. Well, you know, if yeah. Left for Dead did oh. attachments, they should do it like how they do laser sights or explosive rounds. They planned it, but it's scrapped because it's a bad idea. Next, what's the damage output? Well, oh, yeah, 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 fucking, do what's the damage output? Like, uh, the game doesn't tell me the damage <sighs> output. It doesn't Just fucking matter. A gun. Oh my god. Do All the. Fucking, does every fucking zombie have a health bar? <laughs> you shoot them, they die. <laughs> you shoot them, yeah. they die, regardless of gun. Yeah, exactly. Like you shoot every. Them, they die. Every gun in so Left 4 Dead is. E every gun in Left 4 Dead is usable. Oh, that is the thing. Kill. It's usable. I like how Scout has, like, the highest. Only bad Stack. guns are the Counter Strike Source ones, but even then, they can still kill. I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't need the damage stuff. output. I, I, I love this so much. I love the stupid SG. I modded it. I have fast reloads. They're as good as if other you guns shoot now. A gun and they don't die. Just shoot again. Yes. Exactly. I don't need damage. I don't this need a stupid health so bar. Play Left 4 Dead again. Oh my god. <laughs> video is not doing its purpose. Instead of making you think hmm, Left 4 Dead is bad, you just download Left 4 Dead. Yeah, I, 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 oh yeah, this part right here. This is what I'm talking about. When hi, oh. when him and his jackass team is like, because of how the game's designed, it's like, oh, I need to, I need to shift through the, I need to sift through the ammo. Um, what, what attachment should I use right here? <laughs> don't what don't compare should... Walker. <laughs> what attachment should I use? Yeah, um, we're gonna I take attachments. Gotta take suppressor. Gotta take. The Actually, bitch. maybe I should take a red dot sight. Gotta get the bitch we suppressor. suppressor. We won't wake up the witch. No, the fuck we won't. <laughs> there are many things to think about. I, I, I love this gun. Work with my deck. <laughs> Jackass teammates. Oh, they just deciding on guns. Gun types. Two. And they're in a hive, by the way. If any, th this is actually telling me that attachments are bad. They're wasting time, like deciding, uh, should I? Where are zombies there? There is. It's a hive. Like zombies, like indefinitely spawn in there until you get out. Yeah. Left for dead. Walking simulator. Back for blood. Gun deciding simulator. He is still deciding on weapons. He spent a whole like fucking like paragraph talking about how oh I don't know what. Never mind the fact that if you're playing back for blood, then he said sometimes I intentionally take weapons that do less damage. Why? I thought you cared about that thing. Yeah. 
I think this, this whole just thing gives is more just a, players a way to like express a, themselves. Through. I think it's just a back for blood cope vid. I want to be happy. I've mentioned cards a bit. Left 4 Dead 2 players may not even know what those are. Before each running back. What does well, this yeah, mean? Uh, yes, I'm of like, course sure I they know. know. I bet you stupid fucking Left 4 Dead players don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Yes, hey, I bet you stupid Left 4 Dead chuds don't even know. I'm like, sure that's card not how system. he <laughs> intended that to come out, but that is how it fucking. It, that's how it sounds. Some cards give you better stats, like making you run faster, giving you more oh, health. Oh, how is this fun? fun? Dude. Shoot. Back for Blood puts a lot of also, time uh, another the game. Another thing he doesn't bring up about cards is that certain cards you can only get through the game's in game currency, which, like, you would need to do grinding. And some of them cost a lot. I remember that, yes. Gameplay satisfying. Yeah, don't, don't mention that you have to grind to get the, some of I these cards. Out of position in case of Everything involves right. strategy and quick thinking. What are you just fucking around, doing earlier? Later to buy supplies. Neither of these are present in Left 4 Dead 2 because in Left 4 Dead 2, use, the creators want to make a movie. Should I use play the this movie weapon in Left 4 Dead 2. or this every weapon? Every player is the same, and every player has the same experience. Oh you won't God. go to a movie theater and get the Pittsburgh Special Edition of Thor Love and Thunder. There's just the movie, and you can watch it. You can even watch it twice or three times, but... He just he mentioned about? a Marvel Thor movie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he mentioned a Marvel. He said the game movie but sex one. Back for Blood is not sure that. In Back for Blood, you can Back play the same level as this. a sniper DPS role or a melee dock. As an aggro alert, can, you, can you not do that on Left 4 Dead? Or disarm the alarms ninja. Yeah, exactly. It's, well, it's like, or, I, can, I, thing I can change up how I play Left 4 Dead as well. I can grab a shotgun and a melee weapon. I could find a hunting rifle and a deagle. <laughs> I can use a rifle, do whatever I want. I can admit that Left 4 Dead 2 has that I wish Back for Blood did is versus campaign. No matter how many more playstyles and special mutations Back 4 Blood has over Left 4 Dead 2, none of those playstyles is any of those special mutations. For my final- Yeah, you can count on that, on Back 4 Blood 2, if it happens. It because won't. your game is they, not they continuing. Did, nah, their, their game flopped, they didn't make any more DLC, they Back stopped. Blood yeah. Back 4 Blood Yeah, it's hostile, actually dead. And even individual dead. characters I know, should have had better women. more impressive given that We're it has so 11 characters. I still haven't seen them. Well, to here, to here's the characters. I can give it a chance. They're not Zoe. <laughs> so I can give it a chance. That's minus 8,000 points. Oh, yeah, Don. There you go. Car here's Carly the is for you. There you go. And Sheris and Talat. Just try them out, I guess. Is that it? That's it. That's uh, literally it. What does it mean? There are, others are males, dude. Ollie and Doc, too. I played the game. Oh. I've checked the characters. Evangelo annoying. Walker boring. Holly. They are they are sweet baby uh, inspired characters. Eventually so. Zoe, but very annoying. Mom is just boring. Doc <laughs> is okay. Hoffman is the best. Hey, character. I'll take goat. the goat. Hoffman's the goat. He Hoffman's he's goaded. He's person. he's pretty much Peter Griffin Peter in an FPS. Yeah. I'll be happy with Jim boring. Carly Dyke hang. I call this guy Filipino, but he's not. When I call him Filipino, that's funny. Shares skip. What's Carly's full hairstyle? It's the. It's like, like Yamazaki, but on, like, purple. Both sides. It's just Yamazaki oh, no. hair. Oh no. Yeah. No, I'm good. Prophet Dan. Hey, I'm still fine with a fucking Holly. Skeet so. And Tala oh. is just. I don't know. Well, he's fine. He's. Compared to Left 4 Dead 2's four identical characters. Uh, be yeah, careful, because there's a sweet Doc's, people. Doc's probably the yeah. best female, yeah. if not Holly, that's it. Left 4 Dead 1, but makes no yeah, mention of Left 4 Dead 2. He talks about Why story, I love this part. Well, they don't mention Left 4 Dead 2. 2, why is that? It's because there is none. You play as four people who no, don't have to live next to each other and need to be this rescued. Is, this part right here is it. just there's so no wrong. There is no story. You play as four people who live next to each other, no. No, four pe- no, the four updates have intros and they all follow a story. L the Left 4 Dead 2 story is this. The four survivors, like, they got to the evac center too late. It to left without them. Orleans. Yeah, it left without them and, like, like things happen from there. Th there is a story, what? even if it's not very in-depth. Why can't you just leave it open to discussion? Like, just open to the player. Okay, they're there. Nick is somebody, he's a gambler, he has experience in guns like that. Just, 
it's it's just simple. Like, what detail Every do you need? Has a do you want their Do you want their length? Do you want their dick inches? What do you want? <laughs> he goes on about that. It's like, ur, ur, do you want to learn what for... college they graduated from? Like, what? He goes I mean, on about really the back for blood talks about uh, the character backstory and stuff. <laughs> I can't. Wow, these character profiles are so in depth, they list their sexuality. Wee. There are multitudes of people. about their identity and their sex life. Hospital <laughs> is new to cleaning, and the first level is actually his first mission. Hoffman holy accidentally shit, got his middle school retarded. teacher killed when she slipped yeah, down, no shit. down the stairs. Jim's brother drowned. Wait, none of these stories are mentioned when you play the game because they don't talk about it. Don't talk about it. He's just, just he's just right dumping there. me lore, yeah. but I went and played the game. I never heard of that these guys talk about it. <laughs> oh my fucking and yet, hell. and yet I'm sure you could probably think of a fucking Ellis story at the top of your head. Yeah, exactly. T like I don't. When I played Back for Blood, I don't remember don't a remember single that. line of dialogue. Yet I can, yet I can remember so much from Left for Dead. I just one thing I remember is pineapple pizza, and Holly says that. Oh yeah. Quirky. Find on any given playthrough goes pretty deep, but you know, you'd have to actually play the game to know that. Finally, I love this sarcastic. You, you would actually have to play the game to figure this out. Shut the fuck up. That, that goes both even... ways, pal. Yeah, you're a little sarcastic. Yeah, exactly. Only the first two levels of Dead Center. And then here we go. Levels? He was oh, wait, talking about like more is better. Yeah, look, why are there so many levels? Actually, technically, why is there so many levels? Line? Where hold do on. I start? What what three storylines? Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Left 4 Dead 2. Where it's do I start? One. And why are there so many levels? Oh wait, Lord. it's because there are three different storylines. And what? actually, it, he did mention up. like like or, there's three separate storylines. No, the se <laughs> the non-canon levels don't have a storyline. They're non-canon for a reason. Select a character. Well, actually, it doesn't matter who you pick, they all do the same thing, which is nothing. Oh no, please. Please don't yeah, fuck man, that. And I love this part oh. with the characters. Like, Irving, does, it doesn't matter who you pick because they do nothing. Shut the fuck up. Please don't talk about character specific abilities. Please. Taking damage completely disorients your reticle. What the hell is even happening to me right now? <laughs> For all the talk you're of being zombie animations, I feel like I never you're know if You're being smacked by a zombie. Also, um, anyway, there's a damage reticle. It's there to tell you where you're being hit. Like back for blood was a mistake. He talks about how I personally didn't like it, but from the way he's just talking in this vid, I don't think he wanted to like it. Yeah. Like, personally all this vid really feels like to me is just, uh, back for blood exists. Like, it, it exists. Have fun, but it also it's doesn't like... matter, because it's just a movie. I didn't want to watch a movie, though. I wanted to play a game, and I don't really feel like this guy. <laughs> it's B-movie-inspired FPS, dude. Come on. Like I did. But that's it from me. I'm sure I don't have to tell you to leave a comment below, because you probably already did. And that's assuming you even made yeah, it this far. I, in any case, yeah, I bet this has been like Mr. Science now. Mover, and I'll see you in the next video. Until then, Bitch. have a good one, everybody. Ollie came yep. up with just... Back for Blood does this better, even though it's not it, better. He was talking about Back for Blood and not actual Left 4 Dead. Yes. Yeah, exactly. There, there was no structure to this vid, like genuinely. Look, if he called it Back for Blood exists, maybe. Yeah, if, like, if he just, just wanted to talk maybe. about Back for Blood, sure, sure, he could have done that. But maybe I all in that case I would all this vid, all this vid to me was the. Why do people still play this game? Back for Blood exists. Why don't you guys give this a chance? Why don't you guys give this a chance? It sucks. How recent so, was this fucking video? How, Pretty recent. Uh, June seventh. Oh it was this year. Is this post yeah. the game dying? Yeah, well, yeah. yeah it, it's it's post yeah. This came out this year. Ago.